Hello, hello, mom and dad, me world. So we're gonna do this a little bit off the cuff here, but we went to Kona, uh, the big island here in Hawaii, and this was our first time here. We had gone to Oahu before, but this indeed was our first time on the big island. And as you can see, this is the airport where we had come in from. And yes, it is a plane right out there in this little small waiting area. And what a beautiful open air airport. This right here, as soon as you step out of the security area, you are almost greeted right here to this roadway. And this is the area where we had gotten our ride from our Uber to go to the hotel. And when we had made it back to the hotel, uh, first thing we naturally want to do is we wanted to go out and we wanted to explore the area around our hotel, which that is exactly what we did. And we were immediately taken aback by how beautiful it was, where, you know what, we, we knew Hawaii is beautiful, we knew Oahu was beautiful, but Kona, uh, just, just as beautiful. Very, very lush with vegetation, uh, a lot of green. And Kona is also a port area for a lot of the cruise ships. And you can see this boat right here. This is like their transporter boat because it is too shallow for the cruise ships to come right up on the bay here. And so, yeah, we just kept exploring a little bit more of the town. We got hungry. We had to get a little bit of a bite to eat, which we got many, many bites to eat on this trip. But we had to get a few little appetizers and then we had to get some dessert that was right in the same area. Beautiful. Thank you. Hello, hello, mom and dad meet world. So we are over here in Kona, Kailua, Kona. We just came from the airport here. Uh, we are staying right down here in downtown. Uh, we are over here at the Kona shopping village and uh, yeah, it's a great place to stop, get something to eat. As you've seen earlier, we were here for appetizers and then we were here for that ube, that nice ice cream with some pog. It was super delicious. It is out here at night right now, but it is still almost 80 degrees, 78 degrees to be exact. And uh, yeah, I've got a little bit of sweat right here, but uh, we just wanted to check it out. It does close early. So if you are looking to get out and shop, just know that it's about 8.33 and most of the shops are closed already, including this one right here that I definitely want to check out. That's the name of the shop. It's Donkey Balls. Okay, well, I don't know if we can say that on YouTube, but uh, I'm gonna say Donkey Balls, okay? So we got a rental car for only one day. And I will probably say if you're gonna be staying here, depending on how long, you probably want a rental car for more than one day to explore the whole island. It is a vast, big island, much bigger than Oahu in terms of, you know, driving. And what we had noticed was there was a lot of black rock, black sand. Very, very beautiful, just different than what we would see in Oahu. And then the further south we kept going, we had noticed that the weather had seemed to turn a little bit on us, but that is 100% okay. But we had to do a little bit of exploring around, you know, different shops and different vendors that were open. There are plenty, and I do re repeat, plenty of coffee of farms. Uh, we had gone to a pretty infamous one here in Miranda Farms, quite good. And then there's also other different sorts of stuff that people are selling. This happened to be like some fresh produce. And then we got a little bit of a, of a history tour, history lesson in King Kamehameha. Uh, this was right here back at our hotel. And then we had to go parasailing. Yeah, that's really, really odd, especially for myself, but uh, parasailing. And then you can't, well, I guess you can go to Kona without scuba diving, but here we are. All right. I don't know if the microphones are going to pick me up, but uh, the water is super salty. This is definitely salt water. Uh, we are over here in Kona, uh, over here at the King Kamehameha Kona Resort. This is a Marriott property and we are just dipping ourselves in the water here 
on the bay. Uh, we are in this little inlet, this little cove. Apparently there's some fish down here. As long as there's no active visible dorsal fin, uh, that's fine. But uh, we are just down out here and uh, water is kind of warm for what it is. And uh, I'm gonna go down here and then uh, let's get some uh, video of some fish for you. Small fish, but small fish, by the way, small fish. And then for at least one of the days here, we had to watch the sunrise. So here's a little bit of a snippet of the sun rising above these mountains here. Just absolutely beautiful. And this was here from our hotel. It was indeed a beautiful hotel, but that sun coming up, yeah, that was quite nice to see. So you have the pool area, you've got a bar and eating area all right here in this little patio. And it was really, really neat to see. Literally, we were inside the pool taking video here and they're playing music right here, which I, I'm not playing because I don't want to get copyrighted, but yeah, very beautiful. And then we had to take one day out to go to uh, their swap meet here. And their swap meet just had a bunch of different items, different goods, and we indeed got quite a few things here at their beautiful swap meet but overall it was a truly beautiful trip we spent a lot of time eating as you're going to see there's going to be quite a few videos uh, documenting some of the areas where we grabbed a bite to eat and just overall kona was beautiful it was very warm it was very humid but that does not negate how beautiful it was and it is definitely a must visit. Hopefully you enjoyed this video and videos to come. Please like, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.